stop before you recycle or donate that device. You might be giving away your confidential or personal information. Welcome to Safe Sex Sunday, where I take you through quick methods that you can use to protect yourself both online and offline. Many of us will donate older devices to good causes, charities, local high schools, enthusiast groups, but something you might not consider is how recoverable your data is after you do so. Think of your hard drive as operating like a big whiteboard. Writing data to the drive is like writing on the board. When you erase the board or part of it, there's this little shadow that you can see in the right light and you can see what was last written there. And it'll stay like that until either you wipe it clean using a solution or you write over the same spot with new text. Your hard drive works in exactly the same way. When we wipe our drive, there are trace shadows of the data still remaining on the surface. And while you may not see it, with easy to use tools, you can reconstruct all of the data that was there. Thankfully, mobile devices and devices with encryption enabled change this a bit. Because when you factory reset these devices and remove your online account, like your Apple ID or your Google account, you're effectively removing the decryption keys. Effectively, what you're doing is removing the whiteboard's coating and replacing it with a fresh one. On older computers, though, or computers that have not been encrypted, you need to ensure that you've securely erased the computer before donating it. Do not simply rely on the reset my computer feature in Windows. You can do this with downloadable tools from the hard drive manufacturers, but these can be hit and miss. If you're in doubt, reach out to your trusted IT team to assist you in securely erasing your device before giving it away. Or donate it using a service that guarantees secure erasure before sending the machine on to its new home. Till next time, keep those questions coming.